Hello friends, welcome back to She's in Her Apron. Today I'm going to give you a kitchen refresh. This is Monday morning, the Monday after Mother's Day, and my house isn't too bad. As you can see, the kitchen isn't too bad. The family did an awesome job the day before keeping it clean, but this is just from the night. So I am just rising and getting it done. I'm starting this around nine in the morning. And the first thing I'm gonna do is let the light in. Oh, I love pulling back the blinds and curtains in the morning. It just gets me motivated and always feels so good. I've already lit a candle in the corner by the refrigerator, and now I'm going to clear the clutter. I hope you all had a wonderful Mother's Day. The kids were amazing, breakfast in bed, and they helped get the house clean. It was so sweet. All right, this bread box is from Michael's. I've been asked a few times where I got that. And I got it, I wanna say, at the beginning of the year at Michael's. So every morning I do laundry and I fold the towels this morning and so I'm just replacing all the hand towels in the hand towel drawer. and I'm just going to continue to clear the clutter. So now I'm going to disinfect my counters. And this is a home remedy that my mother-in-law gave me, this natural Lysol disinfectant. Now in it is, I'm, I can't even pronounce it, so here is the recipe for you guys. You need alcohol, about 16 ounces. If you use a strong peroxide, it's a half a teaspoon. If you use a less strength peroxide, it's a teaspoon. And there's about 30 drops of tea tree oil, 15 drops of lemon oil, 15 drops of lavender, and eucalyptus. And I'm gonna wipe down my counters with this. It smells really good, really, really good. Do you use a home remedy for like a Lysol, a cleaner? What do you use? I would love to know. Please leave it in the comments below. So for Mother's Day, Felix and Callie came over and they were so sweet and gave me these flowers. So I have some dishes in the sink, so in order to put them away in the dishwasher, I need to empty the dishwasher. And I usually have the kids do it, but the kids were working on homework and I was just really enjoying my morning just picking up the kitchen. I was really in the zone and it was it was very nice. I had some music on, the candle on, and I was just very much in my element as a homemaker. Now that the dishwasher is emptied, I can now empty out the sink. I've also sprayed my sink down with that disinfectant spray. Time to clear the clutter from the table. I did have Boston come in and grab all his schoolwork off and I put all the rest of the schoolwork you see there in the mudroom. Now I'm going to spray off the table with this as well. Right now with the kids home and doing school from home, I haven't really used a centerpiece on the table just because so much clutter collects there right now. So I just decided not to have a centerpiece on the dining room table for right now. Now I'm rinsing out the sink from the spray since it sat there for a good while. And there you have it. All the clutter is put away, the surfaces are all wiped down, the dishes are in the dishwasher, and we are ready to start our day. It feels so good. And I do not mind doing this in the morning. In fact, I'm gonna be talking more about uh, me working in the kitchen in the mornings in another video and so I'm really excited to share with you some things that I've been learning but I really just enjoyed my morning. Well friends I hope this inspired you. 
get your aprons on or whatever it is that motivates you. Light a candle in the morning, let the sunlight in, and it'll just make you feel all good to get going in your day. Thank you so much for joining me and we'll see you soon. Bye.